Although it can't be denied that the whole pop idol phenomenon has made mega successes of more women than men, there have been a few notable male triumphs. Will Young and Gareth Gates in the UK have continued to ride high since placing first and second in the 2002 series. More recently in the US, two talented singers named David took it down to the wire in the seventh series of American Idol. I wasn't too shocked. I mean, anything can happen on this show, but um, the fact that the two Davids are, are, you know, in the top two is is not shocking at all. Was the series winner going to be scrappy 20-something rocker David Cook or clean-cut teen David Archuleta? It, you can't really compare the two. They're, they're just both very good at what they do, like he says. It just depends on what America decides. So they both have very solid fan base. But if you had to call it... I think David Archuleta, he's a lot more wholesome. He's a lot um, more appealing to younger kids and to their moms, very non-threatening. And, you know, could definitely fit in well with, like, the high school musical crowd or... I think David A is going to win it. He, I mean, they both got great voices, and it's they're both very different, but... I think David A's got the momentum going right now. I'm a fan of that David Cook guy. You know, I'm, I think they're both really talented, but as far as just style goes, I'm probably, I would probably lean towards more buying a ticket to go see him play than the kid. But all the best of luck to both of them. In the end, it was 25-year-old David Cook, who had only gone along to audition for the show in support of his younger brother, who got the thumbs up from viewers. The week after his 2008 victory, he shattered Billboard chart records by having 11 songs debut on the 100 in one week. Within three months, the former bartender from Oklahoma had been invited to present at the annual Teen Choice Awards. Just kind of taking it all in. I mean, this is my first award show, so uh, it'll be interesting to see how it all pans out and, and uh, hopefully, hopefully I can go home with a surfboard. That'd be nice. In February 2009, he was overwhelmed by the fans' response to him and his Idol co-stars as they unveiled the Disney Idol experience in Orlando.